Let's take a look at this problem. We have a rectangle divided into four regions. Three of the regions have areas 3, 4, and 5 respectively. Find the area of the fourth region. Before we move on, don't forget to give a like, subscribe to my channel, and turn on post notifications. I'm going to solve this problem with algebra by labeling all the sides with unknowns, variables, inventing new ones whenever necessary. Say I'm going to let x be a length of this side, just this part, not the whole length, and then for this side, labeled in yellow, using the area, we know that it's 6 over x because Area of triangle is just base times base times height over two, so you just multiply, you double the area and divide it by the length of one of the sides. Next, I'm going to lay um let y be the entire length of the rectangle. So say it's y. Then going back to the upper side, we have this small segment. To be equal to y minus x and then using the same approach on areas I can say the width is actually equal to 8 over y minus x by doubling the area and divided by y minus x at the same time there are two ways for us to express the width first is of course 8 over y minus x then the second way is that split into two parts with one part being 6 over x the yellow part and for the other part, by using the area of the bottom left triangle, is equal to 10 over y. So now by expressing the same thing in two different ways, I can equate them and do some algebra. So we have 6 over x plus 10 over y equals 8 over y minus x. Simplifying... We have 3 over x plus 5 over y equals 4 over y minus x. And adding the fractions, we have 3y plus 5x over xy equals 4 over y minus x. Then we're going to cross multiply. And simplify. We have 3y squared plus 2xy minus 5x squared equals 4xy. Over everything to one side, we have 3y squared minus 2xy minus 5x squared equals 0. Then I'm going to factorize. And we have 3y y minus 5x times y plus x equals 0. So that means 3y minus 5x equals 0 or y plus x equals 0. So either y equals to 5x over 3 or minus x. But since y and x are both um, length of some line segments, they must be um, positive. So one cannot be a negative of the other. So I have to reject the minus x case. And if y is equal to 5x over 3, we can return to the rectangle at the top and rewrite the side lengths. So we have 5x over 3. And for this, we have 2x over 3. And then for 8 over y minus x, I can re replace the denominator by 2x over 3. And so... 8 divided by 2x over 3 equals 8 multiplied by 3 over 2x and it's 12 over x. So now looking at the whole rectangle, the length of 5 is 5x over 3. Multiply by 12 over x. And it's 20. So somehow I've managed to find the area of the whole rectangle. 
and so the shaded region is just obvious it's just 20 minus 3 minus 5 minus 4 which is 8 and this is our final answer please feel free to share your ideas in the comments thank you for watching see you next time